Hey everybody, it's Extreme Travesty, and I am back with another episode of Paper Mario Blind. It's been a little while since I've actually uploaded one of these videos. In the last episode, if I remember correctly, we finished the Dry Dry Ruins and we took out Toot and Koopa to free another star spirit. And in this episode, we're going to find out where to go next. Well, I think actually we already know where to go next, but we're going to find it anyway. Now, I was told... Okay, I think I'm in the wrong area for this. I was told that there was an area behind some... Between a couple of houses. Yeah, I'm in the wrong area for this. That I can go behind for an item of some sort. I'm trying to remember most of the stuff I was told. Yeah, I think it's back here. Yep, here we go. Hello. Keep this quiet. If this woman casts a spell on you, it might help you during battle. For instance, your attack power might get stronger or you might get more coins for winning. Other stranger things may happen as well. But do not rely on this spell. By no means it will take effect in every battle. The spell can be beneficial, but it's also unpredictable. Okay. Hello, welcome. How are you? Feeling jolly? Feeling blue? I'm Merle, you see. That's me, a cutie gal you'll never see. I do magic, but not for free. Your luck has stewed you well, for I am a master of the spell. Okay, we're rhyming here. When my spell upon you glows, you might get lucky, but who knows? Do you dare to take a chance? Want to watch my cards dance? Yeah, sure, why not? Let's try this. Oh, how lovely. Very good. Pick just one now, if you would. I'd pay as much as I could. Special course 50, ordinary course 20, petite 5. <laughs> eh, let's go all in. While we're ready, tally ho, and here we go. Let's see what. Okay, cards. Hello. <clears throat> huh. I think you'll find this power might get your foes to cower. It will light the, your darkest hour. Even should you meet a beast, do not fear, not in the least. My spell makes a famine feast. I don't know what you did. See you then. Please come again. Goodbye, my friend. What did you even do? Um. I guess I'll find out when I battle. Now, there's one other thing I wanted to find. Because if I remember correctly, there was a toad here, or one of these guys who told me about a triangle of trees. And I want to see if he can tell me again. Okay, that's the stone cactus. I've already done that. Desert whirlwind, bandits. Go south, just have to lead to Oasis. Actually, I might go there too pick up a couple of things three trees okay there are the three three trees growing in a triangle somewhere in the desert the rumor is that if you jump in the center of the triangle you'll find something good only I don't know where the three trees are I mean the desert is huge I can't know everything okay so I'm gonna have to find them I know I have to head back to toad town but I am going to first head down to the oasis because I can get stuff down there that will help me. Okay, there's one tree, two trees. Wait. Was that it? Was that the three trying? Oh, no. It says jump. Okay. I'm going to get a couple of things. Okay, one HP, two FP. Maybe that'll help. Let me go get a lime, too. I think that helps my FP more. Oh, yeah. I don't have to heal. I'm pretty sure I don't. <clears throat> Let me see something here. Because I gotta find a triangle of trees, and I think. So this is three trees right here, but. Okay, this was it! You got the life shroom. Life giving mushroom restores 10 HP when Mario's HP hits zero. Okay, it's like an auto life. I think that was what I was supposed to be looking for. Well, that's cool. Um, now, there's another thing I wanted to do, and I'm pretty sure it has to do with something I already found. 
at one point. And it has to do with a block um, that has to do with a block of with a mushroom that I had in it. Wait. Oh no, this was the triangle of trees. You got the runaway pay badge. That Mario earn star points even if he escapes from battle. Okay. Well, there's that tri there's that triangle of trees that I missed. Okay. Well, it pays to be uh, exploring, I guess. And my screen's kind of derping on me right now. Oh shit, whirlwind. All right. You know what? I'm actually just gonna skip that tree altogether. Or not the tree, the uh, the mushroom thing altogether because I think I got what I need here. So, I still have this item though. There's a key item I have, an artifact. A strange artifact found in dry dry ruins. I still don't know where the hell to go with that. And I got these letters I gotta deliver anyway. So, I'll probably do that too at some point. I think I might have an idea what to do with that uh, artifact. First, I gotta find the guy. Oh, here we go. Hey. Well, what ill luck. No clues about the ruins. I'm getting so frustrated, I just might have to give up the excavation for now. How very sad. I say. Mario, that artifact you hold in your hand. I knew it had some purpose. It looks like it looks quite important. Do my eyes deceive me, or is that a clue to dry, dry ruins? I found it in the dry, dry ruins, dude. Mario, old chum, I beg of you, could you possibly part with it? Yeah, I think that was the whole point. Cheers, Mario. Smashing. Really, old boy. Soon now, the mysterious dry, dry ruins will rise from the sands that conceal them. They're already... <clears throat> As a brilliant archaeologist, I say it must be so. I suppose a thank you gift is in order, eh, old boy? Here you go, then. Hey, star piece. You now know a bit of the magic of the desert. Cherish the memory, old boy. Okay. Give me a second, guys. I gotta fix the screen. Don't worry, it doesn't take too long. I'm like two feet away from my TV since I have a wired GameCube controller to play this. Yeah, because my video cable keeps kind of derping out on it and it kind of makes the screen all darker and sometimes it'll even the video will completely cut itself off. So, there's that. I still got those two magical seeds I can plant. Well, I'm about to head back. Is there an easier way to do all this? Well, I didn't do any battles yet. Is there an easier way to head back through all this instead of having to go through everything? Wait, I want to see something real quick. I forgot to check that badge. Runaway pay two. Oh, and then I have all those. Okay. All right, I think I'm good. With that spike shield, I can actually kill those clefts without having to worry. Nope, nothing there. Oh God, I remembered. Vulture, you again. Hey there, hold up a sec, partner. Just a darn minute. I seen you somewhere. Okay, we're doing this again. <clears throat> Looks like we're doing this again, guys. Yeah, he says the same stuff, so... You know what? I'm lying to him again. <laughs> Uh, stupid vulture. You should know better. I could have just fell there, but you know what? Might as well just take the usual way. Now, am I supposed to be heading like back like this? I'm pretty sure I can. Hi, Cleft. What's up? Na, 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 na. I don't need to go that way. Mole! You know what? I want to find out what this power is. The supposed power. Wait, what? Okay. 
What kind of crap is that, man? I don't see no power. Whatever. Might as well just get some star points. Oh, it's only one each. Since I've already been to this area. Or however it works out. <clears throat> mm, yep. Oops. Well, I think, uh... On this walk back, I think I can kind of explain why I've been gone for a while doing from doing this. Let's see, last week I was pretty much busy. Whoa, I was busy with a lot of stuff, getting my wife ready to go to my her her parents' house down in Mayville, and she actually just left yesterday. And oh, by the way, it's like 10:20 in the morning on a Friday. Friday, March 29th on, at 10.20 a.m. Probably one of the only times you'll ever see me do this because she's gone. So last week I was busy. Monday I was overly tired. Oh, I never went this way yet. Tuesday I was sick. Hey, I the power up. <clears throat> yeah, Tuesday was horrible. I was really sick on Tuesday. Let's give Bombat. And, uh... Wednesday, I was still kind of feeling iffy, and last night, I was actually hanging with some friends of mine, and I actually should also mention that these friends actually have their own group. I'm pretty sure they all know what I'm talking about, because they all watch this anyway, but those who don't know, they are the Mutual Gamers, and last week, I was officially inducted into the group, which is pretty exciting for me. Because I hang out with these guys all the time, and I was always wondering why I wasn't involved in a group, and I found an egg. Restores 5 HP? Well, I can get rid of something. Maybe. Well, I have enough mushrooms. I never did check all these. So anyway, yeah, I am now a mutual gamer, which is really cool. And these guys are pretty awesome. Uh, the mutual gamers consist of, well, me now. Uh, Rubber Ducky Assassin 3, Boohead 86, Monty 78134, Emperor Shark 888, and Soulsver. That's S O U L S V E R. Just so you don't get confused with anyone who actually has the Soul Silver name. So I'll put all their links into the description. I'll probably also put the mutual gamers link into the description as well although there hasn't been anything done on that channel in like a long time I guess the last video they uploaded was actually an announcement video to announce an update when Nintendo sauce was actually inducted into the group a while back and unfortunately to get me in they had to kick him out and I kind of feel bad about that I'll put his link in the description to Nintendo sauce and it's uh, and the sauce is not spelled the normal way, it's S-A-W-C-E. So that his link will also be in the description. <clears throat> but now we're on the train heading back to Toe Town. But yeah, I've been pretty busy and not feeling good at points, so it's like there's no point in me to record. And since I have all this free time now with my wife and son being gone, I might as well take the opportunity to record. Why not mass record, I guess? Uh, probably if like six or seven, I don't know. I'll, I'll see how many I'll do. But yeah. It's a fun time. Oh, and there's that piggy thingy again. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry, I have a little, little bit of stuff in my throat. Not a sick feeling, but yeah. Now, now we're back in Toad Town, um, I know where I'm supposed to go next, but another person made me just figure out something else. Now, if I remember correctly, that goes to the area with the, uh, play area or whatever that was called, and there's really nothing I can do there. Boohead kind of 
opened up what was in there for me. But this area, this guy, I can't remember the name off the top of my head, but he told me there was something down here and I forgot to walk this way. He said I'd find something good. Oops. Oh, these are different. All right, let's see what's up. Gloombas. Gloombas are nasty Gloombas who live in the Totown Tunnels. Seven HP? Holy crap. They're stronger than ordinary Goombas, but you can take them. Yeah, I know I can. Yeah, they're, they're stronger. Definitely. Just use the Quake Hammer for the hell of it. Alright, I think I can change back to... Eh, Cooper. Why not? I never did try that Star Spirit. Let's try this Star Spirit power. Might as well. We haven't tried it yet. Lullaby. And they're asleep for three turns. Awesome. Just enough for me to kick their asses. Oh, I never tried Dizzy Shell either. There's Dizzy Shell. Days paralyze all. Okay, that's not going to make any difference anyway. Just take them out. There we go. Now you get to level up too. Awesome. Might as well raise my FP. And I'm fully healed again. One, two, three. Oh! More coin! Oh! Spike Goomba! Hey, get over here. I could have jumped on it anyway, but you know what? Oops. I could have jumped on him too because I have protection with that spike dodge badge or whatever it was called. Might as well get the info on this guy too. Seven and three. Well, because of those spiked hats. <clears throat> Damn it. Okay. Now. Whoop. Don't want to do that. Uh, power bounce. Since I'm protected. Well, that was fun. <laughs> um, I'm gonna have to switch him out for well, Bombat, why not? Screw you. <clears throat> and power bomb? Jesus Christ, I could use that. Blow him up, but Jesus Christ. Talk about overkill. Just a little bit. So let's see what's still in this tunnel, though. There's supposed to be something good in this tunnel. Blooper! Oh, shit. Um. This is unexpected. <clears throat> okay. Did I just make a mistake doing this? This is a blooper. Bloopers lurk in the dank pools of Toe Town Tunnels. 30 HP. Oh, frick. They seem pretty unremarkable. Although, you have to wonder how they float in the air like that. Son of a bit. Uh oh. Oh! Wow, I timed that perfectly. Alright, I'm gonna have to power bounce. See how many I can get here. Twelve! Not bad at all. Okay. Who's the best for this? Here, I'll charge him up. There we go. Twelve wasn't... Oh, shit! Okay. 
That surprised me a little bit. All right, let's try this one more time. Come on. Ten. Okay. And I took him out. Holy crap. Overpowered Gumbario saves the day. Yeah, get out of here. So what do I get? You got the Shrink Stomp Badge. If it works, the enemy shrinks. Its attack power decreases. Oh, that's cool. So, uh, whoever... I can't... Like I said, I can't remember what the name is. I think it was like... It was some number than anime, I believe. Thank you. But you almost led me into a trap. So I'm just gonna save right here. Because that was kind of creepy. That was kind of scary. And I'm lucky to survive. So... That was interesting. <laughs> it's glad I'm glad to be back to doing this though, so I'll get a few more episodes cranked out for you guys so I can have them to upload. I actually have something else I wanted to say, but I can save that for the next episode. So thank you thank you everybody for watching. Like, subscribe, and comment in the next episode. We will continue walking through Toad Town, probably dropping off some letters and I'll tell you my other news when I do. See you guys next time.